Does Yo, I don't know what's wrong with that cat, but... <laughs> <laughs> no, oh dear! I just had it. Freaking BC boys, yo! I don't hang out with those guys, Chico. <laughs> Word, yeah. What's up? What's up with your woman? I heard she's been hanging out with all. It's been like, yo, shut the fuck up, Chico, man. <laughs> Pay a dose trip meal for some of that ass, right? <clears throat> and that's when you get into but like, professor. What's another name for pirate treasure? <laughs> shut up, Ted. <laughs> so it's like the immediate <laughs> crossover. I got. I don't remember. Remember when uh, your mom was a senior? Or shut up, Ted. You asked her to the prom. <laughs> yeah, now your dad's going for it in your own room. Hi, Missy. I'm, I mean, mom. I mean, mom. You cracked oh. yours, okay? Yeah, I cracked mine. Yeah, because I can do whatever I want. Sure, you can. Yeah, you know what? We probably should have done a test run on this to see where, because I never. You know what? I'm not even worried about it. Yeah, I mean, Our test I, run will be this. Well, I feel like because of the levels, or it's so people at home. We uh, we have new equipment, so we uh, we just like hopped right into it because we want to get at it. Um, but it's all good. Yeah, no, I think uh, from from the uh, the patterns, like what I'm what I'm seeing there, and then yeah. also the levels that are. So yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, yeah, fuck it. If it's anything like what I'm hearing in the in the feedback mic, you know, the or the you know, the headphones. The, yeah, that would be your monitors. My monitors. Excuse me. Lingo. I just, green room. It's all good. Well, so monitors is anything that's actually monitoring. You know what I mean? It's yeah. giving the the overall collection of everything. It's giving me my output, really. Yeah. It's it's giving you what it's all feedback of it is. for me, but yeah, it's a monitor. Like the lizard. Whoa. Well, that's what I was saying. There's uh, There's ways for us to actually probably have other people on top of this, you know, with the mixture that we have. So, Get on the mic. Well, we can hear him in the headphones, but nobody else would hear him on the recording. So there's there's ways to do that. And as of right now, any guest would get like the the second, the cut rate mic. I mean, if it was right here, right now, tonight, yeah. But yeah. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm hoping by the next time we have a, a guest and we'll have, we'll have a couple more of these mics. Yeah. Yeah, these are really, these are dope. Uh, for what they were and what they are, they're, these are amazing. Yeah, it's working for me. Yeah, well, they, they coincide with the same mixer, so it's all of the, the same company now. They communicate better. Communication? It's all about communication. Yeah, we were... I could we learn were, something from these microphones. We were inverted. Again, Top Gun. Well, I mean, oh, I don't I'm know. not supposed to... I'm supposed to go ding. Do I think so? Something like that. Something. Yeah, no, these are, uh, these are really dope mics because they pick up a lot better. These are supposed to, so it should have a better actual sounds yeah there's and, there's definitely some filtering going on though behind the scenes well so and, a lot and this is the thing is the uh, the other mics were so sensitive in that stuff that it like it kind of amplified it you like know what i mean like there something was like this would be really annoying but well, like you can just barely hear it now because that's the thing is again on the other mics there was always the secondary because it was my mic would pick up you and your mic would pick up you so there was always like a slight delay on top of, which is like, you know, a little bit of like reverb or delay or something like that. And so it, it adds to the sound and the signal. And so now that these are cleaner, it just kind of like skips over that. So there's not that extra little bit. So you're hearing more of, more of that modulation, as you're saying, because it's actually pronounceable. Right, but I wonder, would it still pick up like outside noise if people were having, oh, if people were having a conversation, like definitely right here, you can tell <laughs> that's the focal point. <laughs> Not so much here anybody, or anybody, here, but yeah, like right this here. A, this is a green room test live. You get to enjoy here. But uh, if there were other people in the room just talking, you'd still be able to pick up on them. Like, well, yeah, but if they're you know off to the side even further, like you were when you dipped. I was going to say if somebody was standing right behind me though, from this distance, yeah, that wouldn't be bad. Like it would almost. It's nearly the same volume. You know, it's it's not like all the way out here, but yeah, this is a test. This uh, is only a test. So is this not going to go on my permanent record then? Well, it depends. Uh, it all depends. Yeah, I can. I can actually. It depends on you. What are you doing? What are you doing, Dave? Dave. What are you doing? Dave, why are you pushing my buttons? 
Don't do it, Dave. All right. So I took your compressor Easy, off. Easy, Dave. What? I took your compressor off, which should uh, should help. I have a compressor. Yeah, as well as. Isn't it a Mercedes? Yeah, see that? That just adds so much more static to the background. Yeah. Yeah. This is a this is a test. This is only a test. All right, cool. There, I fixed you. I learned stuff, dude. I know how I know how to like do more things with this. It's cool, man. You yeah, read the hot. instructions? Well, no, it doesn't come with instructions. It just I mean, came. There's got to be something online. Well, that's the thing is I have to like slowly pick stuff up is like I mean, what everybody else is. Not that I would know, but there's something about the online. The, the online, the, the internets. internets. <laughs> yeah, the internets. Something with the clickety clack. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's what, uh, you know. Because I don't know how to Google. Mm -hmm. We all know this. Yeah, we're aware. Hmm. Yeah, I got to uh, hang on a second. I got to hang on a second. We're going to. I'm hanging on. Hang in there, buddy. What are you doing? He's rummaging. No, there's no rummaging. There, there's some rummaging going on. No, oh, he's in the background. I can I know hear exactly where it's at. Oh, there he is. And what it's doing. And oh, we need a tie down. See, this is what we do in the green room. Yeah, I need an additional. Yeah. There you go. Now I'm uh, okay. I'm all strapped in. <laughs> you're. you're yeah, remember, remember, shoes, shoes inside, and safety first. That's yeah, because that's the most important thing. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> Put your head between your legs. Oh, See, even coughing's better. That's good for you. Well, I mean, if coughing could ever be considered better, but well, dealing with you coughing instead of it being like all on mic audio, and stuff, it's audio wise. Yeah, I'll yeah as, long as, you, as long as you don't just straight back up, you have to go off to the side because that really makes a big difference. Well, yeah, plus if you, uh, if you rotate, so which direction you're projecting, if you're projecting away from the mic, it'll... I don't like to rotate. That's not what I heard. <laughs> wow, dude. Well, I mean, you started it. I think you're projecting, but that's okay. I'll project all over you. See what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, skeet, 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 skeet. I don't know what's going on here. Yeah, <laughs> you want to go camping? Wow. There's a certain demographic that's going to gain interest in this conversation now. Make all kind of assumptions about me and you. But there, there ain't no dumbbells in this room. Be, hey, that would be interesting, I guess. Let's go down that road. Yeah, dude, there is... Um, I mean, not that road, that road, but, you know. I'll hold your hand. Speculation. We can skip together. <laughs> ah, see, yeah. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and the cool thing is, like, it doesn't pick up, like, the chair squeaks and stuff and, like... Yeah, these are way better, dude. Yeah. That's why I'm like, I think with these, even even at the other studio, like we it'd be really dope. Yeah, I see why you're so excited because it 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 allows you to feel a bit more free. Like you don't have to feel like every little squeak and it's all being picked up by this super sensitive which this is very sensitive, but it's sensitive to voice. Yeah, these are these are like voice specific. They really are. I mean, they're, that's what they're intended for. So it's not like doing vocals as far as like singing or anything. Because these aren't great singing mics. These are great, you know, speaking mics. Yes. 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 Correct. Correct. I love you, man. Just say thank you. <laughs> Here we go. T minus. What? So, um, what is it? Do you believe in aliens? What's that? Oh, the uh, the questions from yeah, dude, yeah. I I totally answered that shit. Do you believe in aliens? What was it? Do you believe in aliens? What's your favorite dinosaur? And if you ruled the world, what would you do, or something like that? So, um, number one, um, my wait, what was the question again? Oh, the first one is: Do you believe? Yeah, in aliens? So yeah, my answer was: Of course. But there's a lot more to it than just that. Yeah, that was a, that was a um, good answer. Two, uh, Brontosaurus, because it, it's like a Jurassic giraffe. Yeah, well, sort of. Much, much bigger. 
Well, yeah, I mean, that's why I said a, a Jurassic, but it's got that big long neck. You know, it's an herbivore, it just be eating from trees, ain't think, bothering nobody. What are those ones with the the tall ones with the duck bills? I would consider that more like a giraffe. They have a long neck and the hell's flying around here. Um, yeah, and your wait, your third answer was if you ruled the world to modify our education system to truly support the idea of free education for everyone. Right. Yeah, I could do that. That's, that's we're talking about that. That's my answer. That that is never going to change. That is always going to be <clears throat> um okay, my answers were um well, I don't know ex what, how I wrote it exactly, but um it'd be ridiculous to think that we're the only intelligent life in space cuz there's a lot of space in in space. <laughs> it's a spacious place, you know. Just saying. Number two, I would have to say T Rex because it's all about the arms, dude. I was gonna say that. <laughs> it's I, all about that was like my arms. original answer, but Brontosaurus is just really big and dope. True. Yeah, Brontosaurus. What vegetarian too, right? I believe so. Yeah. Word up. Well, that's when you know. I don't have to kill in order to survive. And like a very large animal can live off vegetation. It's interesting to know. Some of the largest animals in the world are vegetarian. Anyhow, and number three, I would make kindness a kind of currency somehow that you could trade in exchange. Exchangeable on the stock market. Mm -hmm. Hells yeah. You're like, I want to buy Make three more kindness. shares of this. Give me a hug, brother. Make kindness to one another a commodity, which to kind of to some extent it is, but like just, I don't know. This, this whole connection to a fiat, an imaginary thing, which doesn't really represent what it's supposed to represent. It's supposed to represent goods and services between, it's supposed to represent an exchange between people. It was a replacement for a barter exchange, right? Where if you couldn't afford something, you'd work it off for a year. Or you'd, you know, have something in exchange. Like if I bake the best bread in town, I give you some of my bread and you give me some of your butter. So it kind of works out, all, <laughs> you know, just to be silly. But yeah, there's, there, there's it's, it's meant to represent an exchange of some sort. So the idea of, of being able to go bankrupt is ridiculous because you don't lose any things, right? It's just like this strange concept that I never understood. I get that. It's a prison, man. That's all it is. It's a prison. P R I Zun, man. <laughs> yeah, take it back a little bit. Word throwback. <laughs> So, B sides hanging out in the green room. Oh yeah, <laughs> this is a B sides in the green room. That's what it is. Yeah, Philly D, Mr. Gemini. Yeah, we. <laughs> dude, I feel like you know we've been doing all that structure shit that I like this because I can literally just hit the button and just like roll on in. Well, this is a test. This is only a test. This is just a test. <laughs> this is just a test. Had this been an actual emergency. <laughs> True hilarity would have ensued five minutes ago. And then you go, ooh. <laughs> or like, you know, whatever. It seems like 10 minutes. I think it's like 30 seconds. Yeah. It's about 30 seconds, but it seems like 10 minutes. Yeah, dude. I think Come some of on. it is the fact that you're like all, all over the I think you this need to stop. You start. Just, this, I know. This I'm, kinda, just, I'm yeah. gonna do that. Yeah. So. Pick a spot and just stick it. Just stay right there. I can't do that, man. I gotta be animate. I'm a peacock captain. I gotta fly. <laughs> Dude, that shit was hilarious, right? Yeah. yeah, that's another one. You really just gotta see it. No, but I mean, that's why I put it in this spot. That way, it's like you know, it'll be part of it. You know, I said I'm gonna be animate. Just deal with it. I mean, I don't know if I like this. <laughs> I feel kind of some way about this, and I have to think about it. You don't think about it. nothing, nada. No, you're not. That's what I'm saying. 
It was Santa Monica Zoo. How is it? It's a bit frothy. So it's like settled. Yeah, I guess. I mean, you can get something else if you want. I just, you know, I wanted, you know, you were, you were looking at it, so I want you to try it. Yeah, it's got, it's a, yeah. It's not what I recall. It's not, well, yeah, well, you know, we get something else. It's cool. It's all right. No, it's all good. I'm committed now. No, it's all good. Well, it's too late to get up now. Are you going to get up? Or are you going to let me? I mean, yeah, I mean, I think, I think we're good at this point because, you know, we're in the green room, so who gives a shit? Is it really going to take you that long to grab a beer? Yeah. It's, it's, it's like right there. All right, it'll take forever. Yeah, no, this way you can like, you, know, you can hang those and then I, and then you get to slide the chair out of the back. way. And I got to get my chair out of the way. Oh yeah, there's like a whole procedure to get in and out of this room and when we're, uh, in this, <laughs> baby steps to the door, baby steps, turn door handle, uh, which is like, that's the, that's the, that's the thing I like about Bill Murray. I mean, he, uh, he plays so many great characters, um, and he just, he really carries that, that attitude of who they are and what they got going on. It's, um, you know, he really gets into the character of it, but they're such like outlandish characters. It's just, uh, it's really dope. Yeah. Just, I'm just talking about the, uh, the big BM, the, the Bill Murray and how dope yeah. he is. Yeah. All right. Let me, uh, I gotta do a little swippy swappy. It sounds like I'm far away. Cause well, it's cause well, he kind of is. Cause this beautiful mic only picks up on somebody when they're right here. Oh, which is kind of good for you because you make way too many noises. Damn. Yeah, if you also notice now because of these mics, there's <laughs> way less crap. That's like all there's there's less stuff to bump it's, into and like it's uh, definitely more streamlined, more mobile. Yeah. What did I say? Ambidextrous. It adds to the dexterity. It's very dexterous. It's very dexterous. Yeah, I've been uh, dexterous. Multi dexterous. Multipass. <laughs> Lilu multipass. Yeah, right. Yeah. He knows it's multipass. Yeah, no, it's all good. All right, take two. Oh jeez. <laughs> Would you? Oh jeez, it my bro. It's all my clothes. I got That's, it all over. Is it on my? Do you got it on the, the chair too? It's like. Oh, dude, you you dribbled all over the chair too. Oh, which is but that that's not how that's you. That's not gonna oh, help. God, I'm just gonna drink. You know, you just why don't you go ahead and just take your muddy shoes and dig it into my couch too? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fucking Rick oh, James on the first sip. Oh, anyway, <laughs> I don't know if I want anything that you got. Keep that over there. What, I, yeah, you has can't dust to do that with the table. We know that now. You got it all over that table and your phone. And it, it, apparently, it's just objects. You have something to aim for. You're going. Dude, at it, went, it. it just it, it went everywhere. Apparently, <laughs> not on the mic though. That's good. <laughs> I yeah, mean, yeah. yeah. Good job, buddy. I thought I know of. Better not. <laughs> Dude, these things ain't cheap. I, but yeah, there's like uh, yeah, you hear like a. Zzz, zzz, zzz. There's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just like smokes out. Oh, great. Yeah, no, these actually come with like a two year warranty too. Yeah. It says so right on the box. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have to register? You might have to register. I don't know. The check, box just says there's a two year warranty. There it's, was nothing to register with. You got me near this thing right now. So <gasps> oh, excuse me. Lord knows what could happen. I got Mr. Chlorophyll guy over here <laughs> talking about Lord knows what. You know, I like to fly off the handle. I don't think you were ever on the handle. What is, where's the handle? Nobody's ever told me this. Well, that's why <laughs> you can't. That's the problem. Yeah. Do, uh, do you make up your melon, bro? <laughs> what are you, what are you doing? What do you, just, what do you no, want to do? I want, well, I think I want it more like down this way and then kind of. Well, so then what you can do is, yeah, literally you can. Literally. Yeah. Literally. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm saying. So it's like, yeah. And then I can really, and then I can, oh, that's lovely. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's where it, you, you get comfortable. That's why it, it has all those adjustments. That's what I'm trying to do. Because we got to make this a natural feeling thing. I got to well, really get. I also don't want you like rapping and bumping into shit and clapping it with your hat. You can click on the wires. But yeah. That, that big thing that got in the way that twanged every time you touched it on the old mic. Yeah. I didn't. 
<laughs> what, do you, what do you call it, that little basket weave thing that it sat in? That was the pop mic. Well, the, oh, pop, the, the pop mic too, but that oh the cage, the cage, yeah, the Johnny jerk. Cage. Well, you're you have the you suspend the mic in. I never liked Johnny Cage. I thought he was kind of a dick. I mean, I like Johnny Cash. Yeah, Johnny Cash is cool. No, but Johnny Cage. Did you imagine Johnny Cash as a Mortal Kombat character? <laughs> <laughs> Johnny Cash, dude, he would like he would beat you up with his guitar and shit as a friendship. Dude, he would he'd be dope as shit. His fatality would be like some kind of slice your head off with a guitar. Yeah, or like sing you a really sad song. <laughs> and your head falls off. Yeah, pretty when it much. Catches flames. All of a sudden, you just like <laughs> you just like start crying and just like melt like Nazi style from like <laughs> do what? Yeah, from um, you know, from um, was it um, freaking uh, not Indiana Jones, the Nazi scene where they're on the island and they open up the freaking oh yeah yeah that shit <laughs> like all melting. Don't open your eyes. <laughs> Keep them closed. Yeah, that shit. <laughs> it's a dope movie yeah it is it really is it's the hot shit it's Dylon 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 and Dylon you want some of this hot fire <laughs> <laughs> sure yeah these are yeah, I think these are pretty dope I'm gonna I think with this we really not we're not even gonna need like too much cleanup or anything yeah yeah, if anything, it's probably just to make sure that I have a straight, clean signal where it's... You well, know. you're going to have to listen to it. But yeah, it, yeah. It would be funny, though, if it's actually catching more things than you're hearing. Well, if you think about it, the uh, the headphones gave us this exaggerated sound because of what, what we heard in the headphones and then what actually was recorded was not identical. So I get the feeling that this is going to be, like, even freaking cleaner. Like, it really is. More on point. Yeah, I'm like way, 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 way. Yeah, but it it, it definitely feels yeah, but def, def, definitely feels like I have to be right up on top of the mic to really get that. You know, like I can't move from this position. If I want to maintain. Well, the great thing is you can actually get right up on the mic and and get like all yeah. up into it, and then like that would have been way louder on the old mic. Sorry, that's what I'm mm -hmm. saying. All I do is go like this. Here we go. Well, see, that's the thing is like this way you don't have to be all that loud and you can be right up in it and it sounds and you great. You sound like a late night radio DJ. 107.9. Easy listening. No, smooth jams. Smooth jams. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, we I'm have, telling you. We have the lover's <laughs> request line open for all night. We never talk about that though on the air, do we? Was that? I'm telling you. <laughs> do I? <know? laughs> I love it. I every time I hear it, it cracks me up. Our, our um, intro. Yeah. Well, actually, I think it's. Is it the intro or is it on the outro? Which I think it's. I don't think it's both. I think it's one of them. Like what? ones I'm telling you, and the I think the other ones I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Yeah, I think it's. Right, uh, it might have been on the outro. I think it is the outro. But one of those end bits. Yeah, you've been listening to, I'm telling you, with <laughs> Philly D and Mr. Jim and I. Sounds so professional. Stay tuned. <laughs> Are you a professional? Uh, wait, what was the question? <laughs> <laughs> well, one is, do you believe in aliens? Of course. Two. Brontosaurus. Favorite dinosaur. And three, basically, how would you save the world? Free, true free education. Wait, didn't we already? Do, yeah. do, do, do. Marijuana affects the memory. <laughs> no, I know we went over that. You're just, I'm, that's where we were. Do I look like the type of motherfucker that likes repeating himself? You know what? <clears throat> Sub zero. Finish him. EA Sports. That's, it's in the game. No, <laughs> that's what I, I, I really feel like saying that when I'm out, like, when I'm out places and I just see all these masks, I, I got to go off on this because I think it's hilarious. Dude, it looks like we're all stuck in Mortal Kombat world. Especially like every once in a while, I see somebody like leaving the grocery store or whatnot, like wearing like a pretty much a black mask that covers like, mm -hmm. you know, 
Do anywhere do you would normally do grow do a beard, do basically. Do 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 and like that whole area, anywhere. Mortal I just, do 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 do. I just think. Sorry, I had to do it. <laughs> just, it's, it's more subtle than that. It's like I'm walking along and I look over and I see a guy coming out of the grocery store and I just think, Sub Zero wins. <laughs> Flawless victory. Fatality. Uh, yeah, it's like. Sub Zero in the frozen food section. <laughs> like somebody left this door open. There you go. <laughs> Quick freeze over and just shut the door for him. It's nice. Good job, buddy. He gets it so cold that the whole system breaks. It's like that'd be hot shit. And then he just punches it and it shatters. And he doesn't care because he already got his frozen pizza. <laughs> what, what what frozen pizza did he get though? Yeah. What yeah. DiGiorno? I don't know. Oh, uh, maybe. <laughs> right. <laughs> I wonder though, is he having a party back at his house with uh, Scorpion? Maybe Scorpion can just like take off his face and like catch it on fire, and it's like. Done. I like, thought he spit more like. No, Ma, he- you hydrate the best pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Tangent burn. Oh Jesus Lord! I want channel seventeen, channel one twenty four, <laughs> channel seven four. Like what? How many channels is this kid watching? Hey son, watching a little TV. <laughs> yeah, Dad. <laughs> Freaking killing me. Fruit, please. Retract. <laughs> Dang thing. Yeah. Uh, you good? I mean, are you good? I mean, I can see you there, but I'm just saying, are you good? Because everybody else can't see you. I don't know how to react to that. And how does that make you feel? Like you're asking me really idiotic questions and it's kind of <laughs> annoying. I mean, was that rhetorical? I don't, is it, I mean, is this like a part of the test? Is it's, that, it's all a test. It's like when they, when the, you get pulled over and the they, emergency broadcast. Yeah. When they like pull you over to do like a DUI check or something like that. Like most of the questions they ask you are just to see if you'll like even try. Cause it's like, if you were truly logically together and all with it, you'd I wouldn't be, like, be able to do that if I was sober. Oh, sh- well, yeah. <laughs> but you know, the same thing of like, you know, Hey, like walk, walk in a straight line or, you know, say the alphabet backwards or, you know, weird stuff like that. It's like, dude, if you're going to attempt to comply, it's like, Instead of just being logical and be like, listen, officer, do we really need to run through these kind of things? I mean, this is obviously not required. I can just sit here and have a a lot, you know, logical, lucid conversation with you and prove my sobriety at this point. Like, come on, let come on, come up out of the car. Plus, just don't be a jerk. You're a jerk. Don't be a menace. You're a jerk. Don't be a menace. Yeah. Don't be a menace in South Central while sipping your gin and juice in the hood. Yeah. That one. <laughs> Boys yeah, I did it. Man. Boys in the Hood. <laughs> what? Huh? Boys in the Hood. That was a classic. Colors. Col- co- colors. We're going to go off again, aren't we? No, Boys in the Hood was definitely a classic. Classic what? Classic movie. Classic movie is what I'm talking about. <laughs> a movie. I don't. I don't know. I don't get it. As well as what? The, There's a lot of things your ass don't get. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See? See how I did that? Yeah, right. I button hooked you on that one. You got me. Right here. You got me. What? Jesus. What? Lord. <laughs> Christ almighty. No, I like these mics, though. I, I really do. I, re- I like them a lot. Yeah, they don't seem to be, to me, they're not as like, there's not as much stuff. They're streamlined a little bit. Well, I mean, you can actually breathe sitting in front of it and not be like, I don't <laughs> Darth Vader making a recording. <clears throat> I mean, that, yeah, that was even picking up all the little. Yeah, on the other ones, I'd have to like turn to the side over here and then like come back in and. Yeah. But... <sighs> yeah. I don't know. It's, yeah, it's much better. It's super califragilistic. It's me allodocious. We'll have to both listen to this on the post. You Don't listen worry. to it. Yes. That's what I said. I said that. Yo, I just pumped out a whole bunch of episodes. I finally got all caught up on like, the YouTube, YouTube stuff. 
It's a booty trap. No, bo- booby trap. That's, That's what, what I, I said. said. <laughs> data fine. <laughs> Nobody asked data falling. Data fine, though. Thanks for asking. Or pinches of power. Yeah, pinches of power, slick shoes. Data was the shit. Dude, data is the shit. Where's data now? Where's our fact checker? <laughs> Why can we not get an email on this shit? <laughs> oh, yeah. I M T E L L I N Y O U at directionsnews.org. That's uh, I'm telling you at directionsnews.org. Yeah, thank you. Go ahead. High fives, VIP parking, uh, all the snacks you can eat. No, dude, you got to be careful with that shit. All right. Some of the snacks you could eat. <laughs> Within reason, and it has to be put past the council. You need approval. There is no double noodles allowed in this house. <laughs> Uh, for the integrity of the show, there is no double noodles allowed. Yeah. I mean, after after everything's done, then you can have double noodles. I don't during. Double noodles. No, no during. No. No, no disassemble. <laughs> no disassemble Johnny Five. <laughs> no. I like it. I like it when he rewires them and turns them into the freaking three stooges. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, wise guy, eh? Knock, 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 knock. <laughs> He's like smacking each other upside the head. Knucklehead. Yeah. Hey, laser lips. Your mother was a snowblower. <laughs> that was a good movie. That, that was, was a feel great movie. movie. Yeah. yeah. Wait, who is in that again? Who was it? Uh, Ali Sheedy. Ali Sheedy. Yeah, Ali Sheedy was the... Uh, Wait, really? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she played Stephanie. Stephanie. Yeah, she was like the one that had like all the freaking animals in her house. Yeah, yeah. Um, the had the food truck and all that stuff, yeah. Like lived on the little ranch outside of San Francisco or whatever. I think you could like see the bay and shit, but... Um, and then what's uh, Gutenberg? What's his name? Oh, and the guy that did the freaking... And who was the tech geek? That was um, <laughs> the same guy that plays uh, the, the evil hacker in Hackers. Oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah. Do is look it really? that I gotta, shit I'm going to have to look that up. Do, do it. Go ahead. Look it up right now. <laughs> no, yeah, I'll fucking look it up. I'm going to show you. I'm going to prove this shit right here. This ain't no joke, homie. Should I know. He avoided the piece of cake. Yeah, but he's, yeah, he's like, it's, oh, uh, hold on. Oh, oh gosh, excuse me. Damn. The Even short. with the good mic, you can still be disgusting. Well, I mean, yeah, it does help a little bit. You know, I get a freebie. Yeah, Fisher Stevens. <laughs> Jesus, bro, what the? Yes. F- <laughs> that was the cockles right there. <laughs> Dude, take that shit off the side, please. I, I would appreciate that. <laughs> Sorry, all. Uh, Jesus, you're fucking disgusting. <laughs> like, seriously, I don't fucking know what's that. They expect all that. It got away from me. It's like a wild stallion. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, no, for real. Is that, would you working with 3G over there? Yeah, no. See, short circuit, hackers. It's like right there. Oh, the Super Mario. He was on all sorts of shit. See? I see hackers. That's a good movie. I remember that one. Right next to Short Circuit. See, Short Circuit. Short Circuit. No. There you go. Hackers. Told you, bro. Fucking Johnny, told Johnny you. Johnny Five is alive. Yup. Yo. You know what? I'm a... With it, in, what is it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you really have to be right in front of the mic if you want to what? If you want to talk about it. Right, otherwise, you're like over here. Yeah. You can hear what you're saying. When you're, you got to be right on the mic. Yeah, which is really dope. Yeah, that's that's the point of having like quality microphones now. So, so I think it's break time. Is it almost break time? Dude, it's what? Oh, I don't know. You still have beer. I still have beer. Well, I technically already drank some of that too. So that does not count. That beer has now been negated, will be dumped. It is a sacrificial. Oh, it's as if I didn't drink any of it. Yeah, yeah. That's how, it, it, it doesn't count for shit. That's how that works. Okay. It doesn't count for shit. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. You can just do that. What's that? Just take something right out of reality. Just that never happened. This is this is my perception. Yeah. This is my world. Yeah. That, I make the rules in here. That, that doesn't really make it true. It does in my head. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe truth wasn't the right word. We had that conversation. I think truth is apparent. Truth? Appropriate. Truth is probably what? apparent. What truth? There is no spoon. What spoon? That's what I'm saying. Well, that's the answer to the question. You know, the philosophical question about um, there's a there's a chair in the room. Prove me wrong or something like that. And it's just like what chair? What room? Exactly. Like, do what? There what? Is, what? 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 There what? Is we no got room. spirit. Yeah, yeah. That's what you want with that. Do you night at the Roxbury? Is that what you did? Uh, that's what I did. That's hot. Fucking Will Ferrell. Dude. I love that guy. <laughs> Although I can never. I, I don't know. I can, I can never quite do that. Yeah. What? Why you? <laughs> why are you staring at me like that? Because you're annoying. Wow. I mean, why don't you come over here and tell me that? You shut your mouth when you talk to me. <laughs> That's right. Do you? No, you still did it. <laughs> <laughs> you shut your mouth when you're talking to me. <laughs> That's beautiful. I mean, it's good to me. Oh, I told our boy about the freaking the gap in the between shows and stuff. Oh yeah. 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 Where are you going with that? Well, because I was just... Uh, or should I say, and then? And then? No, and then! Well, and no. then? Oh. And then, well, no, because he's just getting back to me about it. He said he's uh, he's trying to figure out why it's doing that. He might have to like do a clear out and reset or something because it's not. I said man, that's our, that's our moment of silence after the show. I totally like that. Shouldn't we have a moment of silence? Dude, every time for our listeners, dude, I was going to tear you apart on that. But like every time you're list. on the mic, it's like moment of silence. Every, ooh, ooh. crickets! Dude, yeah, only at your house. Mm. Studio P. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I was talking about, yeah, I was talking about the actual comedic crickles, crickets, not crickles. <laughs> I don't know why it bothers me so much when you're on your phone. Like, it's like, I don't know how to talk. You've disconnected from me. I feel I'm lost. <laughs> Does this help? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's much worse. <laughs> but you have to look me in the eyes as I do. <laughs> yeah. Boots and pants and boots and pants. <laughs> boots and pants and boots and pants and boots. I love that. How could you I not? Really do. Oh. Ah. Maxwell. I love that pig. <laughs> I love that pig. Wee! <laughs> Wee! Maxwell! Mm. We're home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, thanks, Mrs. Whatever the heck her name was. Oh, love that pig. Uh, anyhow, anyhow, what? Anyhow, anywho, you, 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 you and me, we saved all oh, yes. these people. So how's uh how's golf going? It's going really well. Yeah, I'm going to play in two days, and then again on Sunday, and then again so next like, week. Like a match, like against somebody. Well, I mean not against, but with somebody or. Well, so I actually um Friday I'm playing um. A, like a practice round with somebody who knows the course really well. So I'm going to get like, because I've never played this course and I'm playing on Sunday. You get some insider information. Well, so one, I'm going to get some practice on it. Two, I'm going to be able to take some notes and yeah, I'm going to get, I'm going to get some inside information because I want to, I want to bring, I want to bring the ruckus. I want to destroy. I want to play and I want to win. I want to have the best score over everybody. What's it? Why are you worried about everybody else? Because they've all been playing for like 10, 15, 20 years, and I've only been playing for just over two. So if I can actually compete. That can't be your focus, man. Oh, it is for on Sunday. That can't be your focus? Well, because here's the deal why. So professionals, when they play the courses, this is what they do. 
they'll actually play the course. They'll do like a practice round, but they'll play a bunch of different shots and different angles. And so I'm actually going to get a chance to go in and kind of take my notes and play a few things. And cause I will play a few balls, just try to like, you know, a couple different shots and spots. And so that when I come in on Sunday, I'm just, I'm really prepared. So I'm really going to play my best round possible, but I'm also hoping that doing so it like, I'm either competing, if not like actually putting myself up on the board. So, cause that's just, you know, to me, it's a good measure. Cause if I'm even like, like I said, even if I'm just competing, dude, that's dope. I'm all good on that. Plus, your, you know, your having, main focus is still going to be your personal best as current. Well, not only that, but also utilizing that kind of uh, mental capacity of like, Hey, let's get a practice round in, take notes and then stick to those notes when it comes time to actually having to play, like to, to literally perform on command. But remember you're having fun. Oh, of course. If you're not having fun, then you're not doing it right. Dude, yeah, but and that, but it, me being as organized as I am and trying to have that mentality and focus as if I was already in that position of being a professional, you know, you just, you just got to start doing it. You know, I figured the earlier on I start that and really stick to it, the I'm just building those habits now so that when I get to it later, it's just, it's secondhand, you know. So as a recap though, I mean, you just, you just recently kind of corrected your stance a bit. And you realized it kind of changed. Oh it no! Changed. This was the last update. No, that not I got. so much my like, not my stance. You were correcting your shot, so it went in the in the opposite direction of where you thought it was going to go naturally for the way that you position your swing. I guess. The, well, no, I had I had myself set up so that all of my positioning pre shot was to carry a left a left draw ball, meaning that it would actually like hook left. So it would start out relatively straight, but then just like straight off to the left. Um, and as I've been getting a more consistent swing so that I don't have to push to get the ball to want to carry left to correct the fact that everything else I'm attempting to do was causing it to want to go right. So I had to do all those extremes for left to kind of balance it out. Right. That's a better way of explaining it. Yes. But. Yeah. So as I've become more consistent and confident in what I'm doing and how to do it, I've had to pull back on some of those left tactics so that I can actually carry a truer path, getting a more consistent swing, which is allowing me to really feel natural. Like you're not twisting yourself out of position. Like you actually feel natural making well, that. As you well said, as you said, you kind of had to readapt your body positioning because you were used to setting up a certain way, so to speak, that, you know, like you kind of had to retrain yourself now to not pull left now that you've adjusted all these things over time. Well, and the cooler thing with all of it is that it now allows me to truly start to work on shot shaping because it allows me to take a truer advantage of utilizing some of these concepts where you now have your baseline of I can do this nine times out of 10, I can go however many yards straight, you know, the way I exactly where it put it exactly where I want to put it. I'm getting very confident in my iron usage so that I can truly control what I'm attempting to do, whether it's put the ball straight, give it some fade. My draw is not quite there yet, but I'm, I'm getting much better at it. Um, you know, I'm starting to get more consistent drives using better equipment so that I'm... Now, was this was this um, intentionally pulling left something you you have been doing with all of your clubs or everything except the driver? No, all of them. All well, of them. Uh, irons up. So irons, hybrids, um, and driver. Because I just started using my fairway woods. That was like the last lesson I had with my coach and... That one I actually set up naturally uh, only because that's how I learned that club. He's just like, here, set up like this, and this is how you want to do it. So I I never had any anything built into that other than what it was. So it just, because I'd never played with fairway woods until now. Okay. Yeah, so. <clears throat> but yeah, at this point, the only club that I do set myself up for heavy left to compensate is my driver. Really? Yeah, so I put the ball like way forward in my stance. Like the ball is actually like even with my front foot, whereas it's supposed to be front foot should be a little bit ahead of it, you know, like four inches, six inches, you know, whatever. So it's supposed to be about like mid left thigh to, you know, you know, yeah, about that. But instead I have it like dead set straight on my front foot. 
Yeah, but I also don't have a traditional swing. Yeah, my uh, as my coach would call it, I have like the Arnold Palmer finish. So I typically finish with my club up as opposed to like rotating and having it back behind me. Right. Okay. So hey, some of this is going to go right over my head, but yeah, I got that. Well, and so and that's the thing with you painted the word picture for me with shot shaping, especially with my irons, <clears throat> I've learned to where, where I finish can help to predict the path of the ball because it's going to help predict the path of my swing which is what gives you that little bit of a fade, which is the ball going right or a little bit of a draw, the ball going left. So I know now if, you know, I want the ball to go straight or have, you know, a little fade to it. I have to have two different finishes because it, it sets me for, you know, it predisposes me to have this kind of path, which gives me the outcome of that ball. It's amazing to think about. Cause like I've, like I've said before, I've, I've never gotten into golf. I've done chip and putt maybe twice, <clears throat> but it, it amazes me the similarities with, uh, you know, with pocket billiards because there's the physics behind it, you know, as to which way you're spinning it and what you would call it English, right? Right. But that you're doing that on such, your contact point is so, well, I mean, it's probably about the same size really, honestly, but when you think about the, the well, target. a golf ball will compress, whereas like a billiard ball doesn't. True, it's going to react a little differently. Well, you get a larger surface area on a golf ball because it does compress. But yeah, you're still getting and then expand back out, so it's actually bouncing off. I guess. I mean, they do bounce very well. Mm, I mean, they can. Yeah, those things can freaking launch. Yeah. I what? Dude, I can hear the motorcycle in the background, but it's actually outside. I can't hear it on the in the headphones. I hear it outside the headphones. That's how dope these mics are, man. Oh, is that why that sounded weird? Yeah, because you were hearing it outside. That's why I was so like muffled. <laughs> You're just like, wait a minute. What, what was here here? Yeah, it's not in the now now. I like that. Dude, I love these mics. These are dope. This is working. How many minutes have we spent talking about the equipment? I don't know. Let's don't, talk about the equipment all we want. want. I don't want to keep talking about your equipment. You spin me right round, baby. No. What can I call it? Our equipment? Or does that sound even worse? I don't... Wait. Do you want to play with our equipment? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give us a call, and then you'll be playing on our equipment. I don't want them calling me. <laughs> You're blowing up my phone. I'm going to have to get me a second line. We might one day. No, I do. I do for real. I like. I want to have like. Is that gonna? Is this gonna happen? Are we gonna do? I want to have an assistant. We're gonna get some more real talk, though. I think that's what I feel like. That's what I'm feeling right now, dude. I tell you what, man. I saw like experiential, 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 like emotional. You know, actual historical experiential. Experiential. Seriously. Seriously. Dude, you make up so many freaking words. I just octagonal. Yes, I do. Octangular. What does that even mean? I don't who. What's what's Which, high score? Is that bad? Did I break it? Yes. Yes, you did. You're breaking it. Actually, right now. <laughs> You're still doing it. You're in the act of breakage. I don't know. You asked me if that's your answer. <laughs> he's over here motioning off mic. like Because you can't these, hear these me. These are beautiful yeah. mics to be on. I mean, if you could only actually do that. Yeah, well, I mean, even just that would be picked up on the old mic. Like just me moving my mouth over there. Yeah, it would be like. <laughs> <laughs> you can't hear none of that. No. Love it. Dude, it's dope. It is dope. It's the best thing ever. We should stop talking about equipment. Why? No. We, do we need to get it out now? Because this is the... This is the B-sides in, in the, the green, green room. room. The green room. I want to hear your best radio announcer voice. One, two, three, go. 
I don't, I don't even know what I'm supposed to do right now. I don't know. We're just one, two, three, go. Is this, is this like the whole like <laughs> wind up the monkey thing? Is that what's going on here? You have just as much ability to do that to me too. Are you trying to say that you're a monkey? I'm, I, 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 I mean, what genetically? <laughs> no, that's not what I'm talking about. I suppose there's a distant cousin somewhere. Yeah. Plus I already did my freaking radio announcer voice earlier. I did it for Smooth Jazz 107.9. <laughs> the love line is open, taking requests all night. I'll be here to listen. So will you. What was it? What was the? What was the radio station from Rain Man? What was that? Do what? Ninety seven X. Ninety seven X. I don't remember that. For what? He had certain things he would always repeat. Right. Every any time he heard anything, it was almost like a parrot. Rain Man. I guess. Yeah, Kmart sucks. Right, yeah. Wapner. Just, Wapner's gotta, on. Gotta watch Wapner. Yeah. Gotta be back in time for Wapner. Yeah, two, definitely. definitely. Six toothpicks. Yeah, it's good shit. It's good, good. Meow. Meow. <laughs> now quit that laughing right meow. Right meow. My Sam meow? And he's like, oh, I don't know. That's like a heifer. Because you're not supposed to actually say... Meow for meow. You're supposed to use meow as the alternate for other words. Do I look like a cat to you? I know. Do you see me eating mice? <laughs> you see me jumping around all nimbly, bimbly like? Am I drinking milk from a sauce? <laughs> <laughs> I quit that laughing right now. Man, oh. I'm going to have to write you a ticket on this one. Yeah, dude. That shit's dope. I still, that's why I do. I still love the second one. Like for me, I don't know. That's a, I haven't come around yet. I'm still like, mm. I love them both equally for what they are and the continuation that the second one is. And I just pick on the fact that if it wasn't for the first one, the, the second one would mean very little. It's still funny, but like the real um for the jokes is that you've already heard them all and they're just being told in a slightly different way. Uh, I mean, there's something to that, but the fact is, so some of the jokes being- What's current fresh? Well, but see, I think that one by itself is a standalone, you know? So the add-on of like- See, I don't know. When they're outside with the signs and, he, and he's like, glittery man, glittery man. He's like, I love it. It's like we never left. Okay, that one wouldn't be as funny. Well, that was a true shout out to, the, to what was going on throughout the entire movie, really. Kind of, yeah. Well, I mean, because- not every single one of them was, I mean, because did, did they do the repeater? I don't recall them ever redoing, like doing the repeater. Well, no, because it wasn't, it wasn't like a word for word, but there was some kind of a balance throughout the whole movie. Yeah. Like you when, could almost watch the two. When they like ride up on horses and they're just saying French phrases like chicken cordon bleu <laughs> and shit like that. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, that stuff's fucking hilarious. You kidding me? It's the again. Oh, dude, they this just, is the whole point. This is <laughs> like they just keep going and going and going, right? Because that's what I'm telling you came from. It's the yeah. again, sort of, but yeah. The 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 key to the key the to echo. life is uh is uh, a penis in your asshole. <laughs> They're like, what? what? Yeah, no. That's what they keep saying. Like, no, you know. Uh, oh. happiness, uh, you know, to be like a, like to be j joyful or it's just like, oh, happiness. Yeah. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> he's like, and you know, in your, in your asshole, he's just like, in your, uh, I don't, I don't think you're saying that right. <laughs> yeah. No, a penis in your asshole. And it's just like, uh, oh, you know, you're, uh, you're, yeah, your you're domicile. You're a part of, or you're like, oh, household. you're, your household. The, yeah. The, the key to life is happiness in your household. Yeah. I've been trying to tell her that. <laughs> hey, why, why? Why you think I say? Well, what, what we th he's like, no, you can't. You can't do you're like, well, no, what, what we thought was like you were saying, you know, was a penis in your ass. <laughs> no, man. <laughs> <laughs> he gets like so pissed off about it. He's like, oh, you Americans, like, you would think everyone want to fuck you. No one want to fuck you. <laughs> Oh, and they just like run off. That was funny. <clears throat> 
do that whole scene. Was was having you reenact it was even funnier. Oh, thank, dude, it's thank great. You for that. Yeah, of course, man. We really got to start doing skits to really get it on point. That means we got to video stuff. Not necessarily. We could start out with just, yo, seriously. Seriously. For, for a while, for like almost a year, I, I had this kick where I would just, I would listen to old, like, um, what, like 1930s radio shows or whatever, like where they'd, they'd make their own sound effects while they were on. They yeah. was, they'd do their own commercials. Best. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. I think we should bring something like that back. It's I mean, like, it's like vaudeville for the radio. Well, that's, I was like debating cause you know, our dudes asked us to like, go ahead and do like two hour content and like stretch out. I'm telling you and make it even bigger. Well, because what if we started doing like commercial breaks, but it wasn't commercial breaks. It was just like break breaks. Well, and we Green would just Room like, would end up being like 15, 20 minutes. And then we'd just start recording after that and have some stuff planned and some stuff unplanned. That's what I'm saying. Well, I mean, we can talk about it later. I mean, I'm just saying in general. We're going to talk about it now because this is the B-sides. Did I get it right? Did I get it right? I got it right. I got it right. <laughs> <laughs> got it right. Got it right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even with you. I don't even want to get no. Oh, you stay over there. I'm just trying to understand your gig, man. What what you're on about? You know, I don't, I don't even know. How was your childhood? Were so, was it good? Was we, it all right? We've, we've already gone there, and we don't want to go back. <laughs> <laughs> don't be afraid, really. Oh, I'm good. Any of the people out there haven't heard the people? Have they been following since the beginning? I don't know. I mean, they can always go back and listen. Because are they following at all? I don't know, dude. We're we're starting to get there, like for real. Like the YouTube stuff keeps going up. Like we keep getting more and more counts and more subscribers. Like it just it, it doesn't mean anything to me until you know there's a lot of response coming back though. Yeah, I do to look me, forward to more and more of that, which is really dope. Like you know, what the heck is there's like a tiny gnat in here right now. I mean. Like he's just chilling with. Is us. it like smaller than a, a an actual gnat? Is that is that why you said tiny? Because I mean, because gnat. gnats are already tiny. So is it like a, maybe it's a medium sized gnat? Is that better? Well, I mean, why why do you have to label it? I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> why can't the gnat identify with whatever? It wants? Look, I don't identify with any of it. <laughs> None of it. Oh, I'm just kicking crap. Um, Yo, none of it exists, man. No, it's not crap. That was my printer, bro. <laughs> well, it's a cannon. Why you gotta be like that? <sighs> See, that's it. I What's it, with it? You. Me? Well, I mean, I'm already done drinking beer. What are you doing? I'm, I'm just drinking oh, coffee at this moment. I'm close here. Let's. Are you sure? You just breathing heavy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Is yours raisin too? Mm, anyway. Oh, this is good coffee. This is from up the street. Oh, now that you've finished your beer, you're on the coffee? Yeah. I just, you know, it's the it's that time of year. It's nice to have a a heated beverage in my Jurassic mug. <laughs> Sorry. Don't do it. You suck at it. No, I was just I was just thinking to myself how really horrible that sounds. Jealous. I'm not. I yeah, think I are. could probably do better. It's your judgment. <laughs> you cast your judgment across the room to me. Well, technically you're you're closer to a corner than I am. What is that supposed to mean? You're the one that's judging because you're in the corner. I am not judging. Get in your corner. See? And you're you're do it. You're over here projecting Do all it. kinds of projecting skeet skeet, projecting all kinds of crap oh, skeet, on me. Skeet 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 skeet. <laughs> I don't want your projections. I don't like it. It's like the sprinkler. I don't like your insinuations. Y'all I don't appreciate them. all over you. You see, you see what I have to put up with. You know, always talking about what you have to put up with. You know. Uh, I mean, Real. it just sucks to be you right now. Where's the counselor? In the other room. Is this after hours? They're like listening in. Are they? They're waiting. Wait, they came. They're oh, taking I'm, notes. I'm, they? There's multiple counselors for us? Well, I'm not going to cause them to be identified with any signifier, so I'll just use them and they. 
what up? What's it going to be now? Like G? Is that what? really? Is that where you're going? Algier? What? No. Al Jazeera? That's. <laughs> <laughs> Al Jazeera, what? Ouch, my ear. Did, did you really say that? What? Huh? What? What? It's, oh, my beer's almost finished. So you know what that means? Time to start kicking ass. <laughs> kicking names. I'm going to kick some names and take some ass. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, that's how I do it. I'll be name dropping. That's how we all do it in the on the B sides in wow. in the green room. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, don't break your arm. I am your own back. T E L L I N Y O U at <laughs> And now everything I say is going to be covered up with. And then when I try to what why they still my stapler. <laughs> It's my tabler. Donde esta? What? <laughs> Donde esta la biblioteca? <laughs> no, no, ay, Dios mío. No, 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 hay biblioteca. Ay. <laughs> sí. Ow. Ow. Dude, what the? I bumped into stuff. But notice how that wasn't even that loud, even though I like totally clocked that shit. Yeah, there's like isolation within the mic after the... I'll remind anybody who's actually been listening the entire time. It's me that always has the equipment issues, right? Wink, wink. Just... Uh, you look really gross when you do that. You look <laughs> really gross when you don't. And you're sipping from your dinosaur cup. Jurassic mug. Dinosaur cup. Jurassic mug. Dinosaur cup. <laughs> Jurassic mug. <laughs> Dinosaur No, and then. Duck season. Rabbit season. <laughs> it sounds like it's getting to be that time. Oh, it's well past the time. Is it past the time? Oh, it was. It I'm was not passing the time. I'm just, I got to finish this though. Yeah, that's right. You crack it, you drink it. Get the other one too. Man up. Because this is the B sides. B sides. Yeah, this is where you get all tuned up. So that you can deal with me when we have to be serious. Tuned up. Yeah. That's how it works. You didn't know that? I did that just now. I stacked that. Oh, aren't you just so fancy right on now? On top of the can that Just think you're just so special. The can that doesn't exist. I did that. There is no spoon. None of this is real. I feel that. I really do. You know what reality is? Perception. It's the worm on the mushroom in Alice in Wonderland. That's reality. I thought it was a caterpillar. That thing, yes. The caterpillar that turned into a butterfly later, yes. That guy. Why is it going to be a guy? It was a guy, wasn't it? Dude, what? Excuse me. Wow. <laughs> I mean, that was much better than it would have been, but <sighs> this, this whole show was a test. Just relax. Yeah, we're about to find out. <laughs> All yeah, because right. we're going to take a break now. And uh, yeah, gonna, then we'll come back and do what I'm telling We're going to wrap you. this ish up. But one more time, anybody wants to reach out because we really need people to reach out. Not that this is a desperate thing at all. We've got plenty of people already reaching out to us, but I'm just saying. Why doesn't it? Is, <laughs> <laughs> come on, finish me out. It's a, yeah. <laughs> you better leave money on the dresser. I said, finish me off. I said, finish me off. Dude, I'm pretty sure our parents listen to this stuff, man. Are you sure? <laughs> uh, my dad's asleep by now. <laughs> There's so many things to say about that, and I'm not even going to do it. Huh? What? Exactly. I don't want to. You can't make me. About me? What? What? Oh, my God. All right. Yeah. Um, well, you did the... <laughs> no, you did the... And then the... I-M-T-E-L-L-I-N-Y-O-U at directionsandmusic.org. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. <laughs> yeah. Um, Hit us up. This is Mr. Gemini. I'm Philly D. In the green room with the B-sides. In, in the green room with the... Yes. That is... Yes. I was... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're good. You... 
<laughs> You're good. I'm going to have to go ahead and ask you to come in on Saturday. Yeah. That'd be great. Is that how we're going to finish this? Oh, um, be good to yourself. Be good to everyone else. Peace. Peace.